centuries and centuries it seemed we were destined to be the best of enemies the worst of neighbors with barely 20 miles of sea but plenty of history and foes are me to separate us but somehow over time we put our grievances behind axes we used to grind were buried in the ground Across the channel waters, we channeled our resources And barriers and borders tumbled down Deep beneath the seabed and high above the ocean Engineering poetry in motion We made supersonic planes and underwater trains Sharing the gains of shared endeavour When we tired of our wars that dragged on forever We made supersonic planes and underwater trains together Half English and half French was the language of joint ventures Back in the late 20th century Took a 50-50 share when Concord ruled the air And we built a railway under the sea So what if I say fuselage and you say fuselage Our differences were bridged with an entente cordial We made supersonic planes and underwater trains Sharing the gains of shared endeavour When we tired of our wars that Dragged on forever, we made supersonic planes and underwater trains together. When we built those planes and trains, it must have been a golden age. Cause lately we've been tetchy with our neighbours. Concourse long retired and channel crossings are a byword for our small-minded Brexit island status. We queue up for our passport stamps and brew up fears of migrant camps, denying refugees a chance of sanctuary. So proud to land a dodgy deal with Rwanda, we won't reach a hand across the sea. What happened to our Entente Cordiale? Did the wheels come off our dreams? Have they been dumped in the canal? Have we seen the end of Anglo-French cooperation? Were we just foes amis that got lost in translation when we tired of our wars that dragged on forever and saw that we could share rewards of shared endeavour? If the stars align again one day, I wonder whether we'll make supersonic planes and underwater trains and say, look, there goes Concord again together.